It started really actually uh, over 20 years ago when uh, Dr. Dougal knocked on my door and uh, came in with this interesting idea of using uh, infrared light as, as a therapy. But he, what he wanted to know from me is how it actually could possibly work. So nitric oxide improved blood flow, so that's clearly shown by our wavelength, uh, improving the battery function in the cell. It's also anti-inflammatory, so inf inflammation is another major cause of dementia and major cause of problems as you age as well. So it's got you know, multiple mechanisms that are all in the positive direction, if you like. So it's a very unusual type of therapy, single type of non-invasive therapy that gives you multiple uh, beneficial effects, which is what you need for a complex disease like ageing and a complex disease like, like Alzheimer's disease. The therapy works by um, improving cellular function and in the case of, of dementia, improving uh, neuronal interconnectivity. In other words, parts of the brain as we get older don't, don't connect as well as they could. And with, uh, with the light therapy, those connections are, are, are revitalized. How it works from a patient's perspective is, is fairly simple. I mean, they basically take the device out of, out, of the, out of the box. There's a power supply that comes with the device. They plug it in um, and they put it on their head and push the button at the back. And it's self-timed. It monitors the light therapy um, that's been applied to the, to the head. And after six minutes, uh, there's a, a beep and a buzz and it switches off and it's done. And they do that twice a day. I did it over a period of three months. Um, I slept better, more relaxed. Um, I felt as though I had a lot more energy um, within the period of three months. Um, it, I started to see an improvement over, I would say, after using it for about two weeks, um, memory was a lot better where I used to have to write simple requests down um, I didn't have to. My memory slowly but it did definitely improve, definitely. This, this pilot study, this was initially looking at healthy individuals that didn't show any degrees of dementia so we obviously that's our selection criteria we choose individuals that are healthy aging uh, individuals and we found that treating them with the treatment compared to a, a sham uh, treatment it improves some of their key aspects of their of their cognitive performance and their motor performance so it's some aspects of their long-term and short-term memory were improved by by the treatment and so, and also to some degrees of mobility seemed to improve with the, with the treatment as well the other clear thing to also consider now certainly in the UK is to promote and develop a clinical trial in dementia cases because at the moment We've, we've uh, had run trials successfully in the States with this treatment with very positive effects generating you know, changes in, in, in memory that are unheard of so it's effective and safe in dementia cases so we're, we're now in the process of uh, tr trying to uh, get this um, developed and run in the UK.